Engineers learn from the consequences of natural events such as earthquakes and hurricanes. After each event, teams of engineers are deployed to gather data from our cities to mitigate the consequences of future events. These reconnaissance teams are deployed to gather vast amounts of data, moving quickly to capture perishable data before they are destroyed. The images collected may focus on buildings and building components and may document specific damage to the columns and beams, such as shear cracks, buckling, or spalling. Other images may contain useful metadata, such as watches, GPS devices, drawings, or measurements. These should be separated out before generating a report about those events. Tens to hundreds of images are collected from each building after the event, and thousands of images overall are used to record the consequences of the event. This takes a great amount of time, and researchers at Purdue University have developed ARIO with support from the National Science Foundation. Pre-trained classifiers embedded in ARIO allow for automated reconnaissance image organization. To generate a report, one chooses reports in the top left sidebar, types the name of the report, the date, and clicks Submit. Then one can choose the files that are part of that building report by clicking on those, selecting the images, and uploading. Uploading depends on the speed of your internet, but in just a few seconds, a report is generated and the images are automatically classified into various categories. Power of this tool, we've collected 107 building data sets from a variety of events that took place in the past. These were collected during real reconnaissance mission to inform researchers and design codes. Set of buildings has considerable variety. All are reinforced concrete buildings of different shapes and sizes, and we have a number of different categories that are used to generate the report. Here we show the reports generated for all 107 buildings. Each can be identified by an overview image that's provided along with the title, the date, the number of images, and the identification of that particular case. For each individual report, at the top, an overview image is provided to show what the building looks like, as well as a Google map that shows the location of that building within a city. We hope that engineers and scientists will use this tool in future reconnaissance missions. If you are interested in using the tool, please contact us. Thank you for your attention.